parents of St. Louis public school students will soon be getting a financial incentive to drive their kids to school. A lack of school bus drivers leaves the district desperate for solutions. Fox 2's Jeff Bernthal joins us live with why the district will actually pay parents to take their kids to class. Jeff? That's right, Mandy. And another bit of news tonight, uh, you know, the district sent out a request for proposals. That window has closed and the district tells us it has received more than 15 proposals to replace Missouri Central School Bus. That's the company that recently announced it's ending its contract with the district. Parents say bus service has been unreliable. St. Louis Public School sends notices each school day alerting parents which bus routes will not be running due to a lack of drivers. I think that's crazy that we don't have enough people in, in the workplace to uh, drive the buses to get kids to and from school. Well, first, um, our sincere apology. The district's chief operating officer tells us in areas where bus service has failed, parents are receiving a notice they're eligible to receive a $75 gas card each week they take their children to school. There are some criteria that will go with the gas cars. We will have some attendance criteria that will be spelled out as we communicate that to our families. And starting May 13th, all families will be eligible for $75 through a cash transfer app. This is our best effort to ensure that our students, our scholars re receive reliable transportation. The district implemented a similar program two years ago when the school year started with not enough bus drivers. This is a nationwide problem or issue. However, we want to here at St. Louis Public Schools, we want to be the, the beacon uh, to say that we found a solution to ensure reliable transportation. Frustrated parents hope the incentives work. It's a little more hassle on a parent, but at the same time, when it comes to the safety of your children, the no hassle is too much. Coming up on Fox 2 News at 10, we'll tell you what the district says happened back in 2022 when they implemented a similar program back then. Again, the district will be notifying parents about their eligibility moving forward and say for next year, all options are on the table as they look to address the issue. Reporting live from North St. Louis, Jeff Bernthal, Fox 2 News.